Hello? How does one describe the awesomeness of the last unicorn? It's, it's just amazing. Every character in the book, whether they're small or major characters, are captivating. And honestly, you could practically make a novel on each of them on their own. Um, I'll try to give you a basic summary of it without spoiling it for you, because this book's awesome. Um, unicorns, got this, unicorns can enchant a land, as it were. Keep it always springtime, when, no matter the time frame. So, whenever a unicorn's around, it sort of is like a magical gardener. <laughs> well, at least in this book. Um, anywho, and as such, two strangers happen to cross the uh, unicorn's land. And basically, one guy actually figured out that a unicorn lived here. And thus, he told and warned the unicorn that he, she was the last of her kind. The unicorn heard this in shock. And, um decide to go on a quest to um to, to find all the other unicorns find her brethren as it were um one thing more you should know about the unicorns is they're immortal so i i don't want to it, it just has a, a part in the book that's awesome um and what happens is on her quest she meets a ton of great characters a bumbling wizard and and um uh, other such characters. The funniest thing about the wizard is that he knows how to use real magic, but he always uses it wrongly. What I mean by that is, um, he may intend to put a magic, any, do any magic trick of real magic and throw it at someone, but it accidentally hits it at someone else. <laughs> yeah, um... There's other great characters too, but I just don't want to spoil it for you. Um, ooh. The book also has great artwork, as you can see. Beautifully done. And also, if I can find it, they also have poetry. Ah. Who has choices need not choose. We must to have none. We can love, but what we lose, what is gone, is gone. See? Verses like that are scattered between the book, and it's beautiful. It's just beautiful. The poetry is awesome. The stories are awesome. The mythicness are awesome. It's just a damn good book. So if you love fantasy, read it. Seriously, it's awesome. Full of adventure and imagination and fascinating characters and good humor and just, it's a well-told story. So yeah, Peter S. Beagle's The Last Unicorn. I think I spelled that right. Well, till next time.